Signing in to Media Center UX is super easy. The first thing that you want to do is open up a supported browser on your computer. A list of supported browsers can be found in the Media Center UX README. Many versions of Google Chrome, Safari, and Internet Explorer are all supported. Once you're in that browser, navigate to the address bar, and here you'll want to type in the host name of your Interplay Common Services server. Or if you have a cluster set up, you'll want to type in the host name of that cluster. Although it's not recommended by Avid, you may also enter in your IP address for the central server or cluster as well. Here, you'll be greeted with the Media Central login screen. Media Central UX lets you use a single username and password to access all Avid systems your account is configured for. For example, a journalist might have access to both an Avid iNews database and Interplay production database, while a logger might have access to just the production database. Type in your credentials here and hit enter. The first time that you sign into Media Central UX, you might be required to change your password if this already hasn't been done for you by your administrator. Next, you're given the option to sign into iNews or Interplay Production. Supplying the credentials for those services, you make it so your Media Central login works for any future sign ins. You can find your iNews and Interplay Production credentials in their respective sections inside the User Settings dialog box, which you can access from the Home menu, right here. Well, that's it. We're signed in. And to fall in love over and over again, check out the other amazing videos at avid.com forward slash how to.